Hi, my name is Alex Etheridge, and my two words are exhausted and free. When I was growing up, I thought what it meant to be a Christian was to go to church, to go to youth group, um, and I had also heard that you needed to be forgiven for your sins. Um, but I thought that when Jesus died for our sins, I thought that uh, you had to continually ask for forgiveness. Um, and so what I would do is I can remember multiple occasions uh, seeing sin in my life and asking Jesus for forgiveness as a way to save myself. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't quite understand um, what the Bible had to say, and I was exhausted. Uh, I was exhausted trying to continually be forgiven and, and seek God and be accepted, and, and I didn't understand how that all worked. Um, it wasn't until uh, high school, my junior year, that I went to a conference, and I think I really heard that Jesus died not just for my past sins or my present sins, but he also died for my future sins. Um, and that was something that really resonated with me and the exhausted nature that I was feeling when I would, when I would feel how, how prideful I was or how judgmental or how selfish um, and not know how to continually go to God to ask for forgiveness as a way to save myself. Uh, that was so freeing, which is my second word, um, that I didn't have to continually ask for forgiveness to be saved. Um, when Jesus went and died, he died for all of my sins. Um, there's a verse in Colossians that really resonated with me, and it's in 2.13, and it says, You who are dead in your trespasses, God made alive together with him, by canceling the record of debt that stood against us with its legal demands, this he set aside, nailing it to the cross. And it was really freeing to know that my future sins especially were also nailed to the cross. God saw those coming. Uh, he knew that that would happen. And he forgave those as well by taking through Jesus the death that I deserved. He then, uh, through faith, made me alive in Christ. And so my junior year, uh, I accepted Christ into my life and I understood uh, what it meant to have a relationship with him. It wasn't about just continually trying to be accepted by asking for forgiveness, but it was this freeing he was in relationship with me uh, because I had accepted Christ uh, in my life. Those are my two words.